If you're living with diabetes or have a loved one managing the condition, you're already familiar with the constant vigilance it requires. Monitoring blood sugar levels, ensuring the right medications are taken, and following an appropriate diet are daily tasks. However, there's another dimension to diabetes that isn't discussed as often, but is equally important. Nutrient deficiencies. Diabetes, with its varied implications on metabolism and organ function, can make individuals more susceptible to a lack of certain essential nutrients. Dive with us as we explore the top seven most dangerous nutrient deficiencies that diabetics often face, backed by scientific studies. And don't forget to stick around till the end, where we uncover the most critical deficiency of them all. Before we continue, if you appreciate all the information and the research that goes into making a video like this, it does help out tremendously if you hit the like button and hit subscribe. Thank you and let's begin. Starting our list is the sunshine vitamin, vitamin D. It's no secret that many across the globe, diabetic or not, struggle with adequate vitamin D levels. The sun is our primary natural source, but lifestyle changes have made outdoor activities less common. For diabetics, this deficiency holds added significance. A study published in the Diabetes Care Journal found a compelling link between vitamin D deficiency and insulin resistance, as well as diabetes itself. The implications? Reduced vitamin D levels might not just be a consequence of diabetes, but could play a role in its onset and progression. Next up is a mineral we often associate with bone health, but its role goes beyond that. Magnesium. The association between diabetes, especially type 2, and magnesium deficiency is well documented. The Journal of Internal Medicine published a study suggesting that low magnesium levels might exacerbate insulin resistance. This means that the body's requirement for insulin increases, making blood sugar management all the more challenging. Magnesium's role in cardiovascular health also makes it essential, given the heightened risk of heart-related issues in diabetics. Speaking of cardiovascular health, our list wouldn't be complete without omega-3 fatty acids. Commonly found in fatty fish like salmon and mackerel, these fats are champions in reducing inflammation. A study in the journal Diabetologia found that diabetics who consumed higher amounts of omega-3s had a lower risk of heart disease. Considering heart ailments are a significant concern for diabetics, omega-3s are undeniably crucial. On to another mineral with a big role in a small amount, zinc. Vital for the proper function of many enzymes and proteins, zinc has a special relationship with diabetes. The American Journal of Clinical Nutrition presented a study that highlighted zinc's role in insulin production and utilization. An imbalance could mean trouble in the body's ability to produce and use insulin efficiently, making blood sugar management that much harder. Switching gears a bit, let's discuss potassium. If you've ever had a muscle cramp and someone recommended a banana, you've indirectly discussed potassium. This mineral is vital for many functions, including muscle and nerve activities. For diabetics, Potassium holds an even higher pedestal. The journal Diabetes Care featured a study linking insulin's ability to move glucose into cells and proper potassium balance. Both extremely low and high blood potassium levels can be dangerous, affecting everything from heart rhythm to kidney function. Our penultimate nutrient is one you might not hear of every day but is incredibly significant for diabetics. Chromium. Chromium is a trace mineral, which means our body needs it in minute amounts. However, its role in enhancing insulin action is monumental. The Journal of Nutritional Biochemistry showcased a study indicating the benefits of chromium supplementation for some people with type 2 diabetes. While more research is still underway, the initial findings spotlight the mineral's significance. And now, the moment you've been waiting for, the most crucial deficiency for diabetics, vitamin B12. Here's the twist. The deficiency isn't directly due to diabetes, but rather a side effect of one of its most common medications, metformin. Vitamin B12 is indispensable for nerve function. A deficiency can lead to neuropathy, a nerve damage condition already prevalent in diabetics. The British Medical Journal published a study revealing that long-term metformin use could lead to reduced vitamin B12 levels. The double jeopardy here is concerning. Diabetes increases the risk of neuropathy, and its medication potentially exacerbates the issue by lowering B12 levels. Managing diabetes requires a combination of medication, lifestyle changes, and regular monitoring. Here are some essential things to do when taking medications for diabetes. Follow your healthcare provider's instructions. It is crucial to follow your healthcare provider's recommendations precisely. This includes the prescribed dosages, frequency, 
and any specific instructions for taking your medications. Your provider has tailored your treatment plan based on your individual health and needs. Monitor blood glucose levels. Regular monitoring of your blood glucose levels is a critical aspect of diabetes management. Your healthcare provider will recommend when and how often to check your blood sugar. This data helps you and your healthcare team adjust your medication or treatment plan if necessary, ensuring your blood sugar remains within a healthy range. Maintain a healthy diet. Working with a registered dietitian can help you create a personalized meal plan. Focus on a balanced diet that includes whole grains, lean proteins, plenty of fruits and vegetables, and portion control. A well-balanced diet can help stabilize blood sugar levels and manage weight, which is important in diabetes management. Regular exercise. Exercise is a powerful tool in managing diabetes. It helps lower blood sugar levels and improves insulin sensitivity. Before starting any exercise program, consult your healthcare provider to ensure it's safe and appropriate for your specific situation. They can provide guidance on the type, duration, and intensity of exercise suitable for you. Stay hydrated. Staying well hydrated is essential for diabetes management, particularly if you are taking medications that can increase the risk of dehydration. Dehydration can affect blood sugar levels, so be mindful of your fluid intake and maintain adequate hydration. Learn about medication side effects. Different diabetes medications can have various side effects, which may include gastrointestinal issues, weight gain, or hypoglycemia, low blood sugar. It's crucial to be aware of these potential side effects and communicate any unusual symptoms or concerns to your healthcare provider. They can adjust your treatment if necessary. Be prepared for hypoglycemia. Always carry glucose tablets, candy, or a snack that can quickly raise your blood sugar in case of a hypoglycemic episode. Being prepared can help you manage these situations effectively. Regular medical checkups. Schedule regular checkups with your healthcare team to review your medication and overall health. These checkups are an opportunity to discuss your diabetes management, make necessary adjustments to your treatment plan, and address any concerns or questions you may have. In wrapping up, it's clear that nutrient deficiencies in diabetics are a multifaceted issue. They range from those arising due to the disease's metabolic nature to those stemming from its treatment. Awareness is the first step. Regular screenings, a well-balanced diet, and consultations with healthcare professionals can help manage and even prevent these deficiencies. If you or someone you know is grappling with diabetes, remember, it's not just about blood sugar numbers. Dive deep, understand the broader picture, and ensure a holistic approach to health. It's a journey, and every step counts towards a healthier tomorrow.